Hey guys and welcome back to another video of Spark Plug. So in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the split phase command in Fusion 360. So before starting, make sure you have an active body in your workspace. So let's draw a cylinder here. Let's do it and press OK. Let me just bring back the origin. So in order to uh, split this phase, first we have to draw a sketch uh, along with we are going to split this particular face. So click on the sketch, click on front view and draw any kind of a sketch. Let's draw some lines here and just drop the sketch. Go to modify command, click on split face, select the face uh, you want to split. Uh, you can uh, choose one or more than one faces at a time. So select on this. It will ask you about the splitting tool. Our splitting tool is going to be this. Then it will ask about the split type. So basically we have three options available here. The first one split with surface. It will just extrude a surface along the direction of the path. You have just created the path or the sketch and it will split the face accordingly. Another one is the along a vector. The difference between a split with surface and along a vector that along a vector command enables you to choose a particular direction. And the third one is the closest point. The closest points uh, the, uh, with respect to the sketch is the is can be is to be used uh, uh, as your uh, splitting tool. So for now, let it be with split with surface and just press OK. Now you guys can see the face has been splitted into four different segments according to the sketch we have drawn. So this is how the split face works with an sketch just go back in the timeline switch on this so just hide this sketch now there are two ways to split a particular face the first one i have just shown is to make a use of an sketch another one is to make use of a plane select this sketch the splitting tool for now let's choose the xz plane if i just switch choose the uh, exit plane you can see that it will split the face of this body according to its face so we have just split this particular face into two semicircular form now the limitation of this command is that uh, if you draw a sketch and the dress sketch is self intersecting in some manner then this command will not work for that you have to use the another way for that let's create a box let me draw a box and let's draw off some profile on this face start by making a spline so if I just draw some kind of spline here remember we are using this to show that how this will work how to split a face with respect to a self intersecting though so we have a self intersecting profile here if i just click on studio sketch let's uh, use the previous command and see how it works choose this face and the splitting tool would be this and if the, as you guys can see there's no option and the error is self intersecting curve undefined error so how to split the face with this particular profile just go to model click on the patchwork space click on create click on extrude select this particular profile and extrude it and choose the symmetry command once chosen uh, click on ok now if I just go to modify a split face click this face and the splitting tool would be this face we have just extruded click ok just hide this body and you guys can see that our face has been splitted into different segments on the basis of this profile don't get misdistracted uh, there is some kind of graphics issue that fusion is currently facing but our face has been splitted into various segments 
So this is how you use split tools in Fusion 360. Thank you and have a nice day. Thank you.